Welcome back, everybody. A good friend of mine runs a local pawn shop. He called me a couple weeks ago about something he thought I'd like. He'd gotten a box of old letters and papers in which he thought I may be interested. I stopped by the shop and there was some good stuff in there. I bought the box and have been going through them for a while now. No idea who they belonged to, but it seems to be a pretty wide assortment. I thought you all may enjoy some of them. Let's see here. Ah, yeah. This one looks interesting. It's from a tank crewman during World War II. My dearest Lucille, I hope this letter finds you well. I long for the warmth of your embrace. I miss you more than you can know. It's been an interesting war for me thus far. I'm not sure how much of the letter the censors will allow, but I wanted to share some of my experiences. I find that writing about it helps with the stress as things seem so much simpler in writing. After training, I joined a tank crew and have been in near constant action ever since. I'm still not sure who thought some of our tanks having an open top was a good idea. It gets really cold in there. That thing's shiny. I understand the idea here of everybody fighting over this coastal town, but awful lot of wasted real estate in this map. Oh my gosh, the turret traverse on this is so slow. Oh gosh. Enemies on the road. So two, I think. Man, you guys gonna come get me? It's looking like it. towards the objective here. I'll keep covering the flank. Whoop! That should have been a critical, but we'll take it. There we go. Oh! What happened? Oh! Two of them! Oh! Ultimately, we all made it out okay, and we even got some air cover while we made our way back to the main lines. Try this. Oh man. Controls on PC are just a little bit new for me here. Let's see. Don't even have a button for Bombay Door. All right.
What? This city we're fighting over isn't even coastal. It's just on an inner lake. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, 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 no. <laughs> I'll tell you, I don't know who that flight crew was, but they were wild. Sarge said they didn't use flaps or something, so they came in way too fast. We picked those flyboys up later, and they didn't want to talk about it. Somehow Sarge requisitioned us a tank almost immediately. Some say he's a sort of legend. With what I've seen him do, I believe it. After that battle, though, Sarge always made us paint a red shape on the roof. It added a little color to the giant war machine. You would have liked it. It reminded me of the chrysanthemums at the farm. Truth be told, I'm not even sure where we are most of the time, but there have been some pretty flowers that remind me of you even during the darkest of times. All right. Oh. The heck was that? This is one of my least favorite, least favorite areas right here. This map. seen anybody coming out of sea yet. Now we got some smoke off to the right. Well. Oh! Motion! You just gotta look left if you're going up that hill. Oh, we got another one. <laughs> Something else up there? Oh, somebody must have got him. Alright. Moving up. to be careful here because our gun isn't going to have enough depression to do a whole lot from up on this hill. Ooh. Well, that's that's in spawn. I mean, well, if, if you're just sitting in spawn, shooting the people out of spawn, then I don't, I don't feel too bad. Excuse me, excuse me. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Man. Oh, somebody got him. what was happening with my repair right there. No, I just want to do my own repair. What's what's happening? See, I was... See, I don't know these areas well enough. Oh, gosh.
I don't know these areas well enough to know the exact distances to all the key locations. It's a beefy sounding shot up there. I'm a bit surprised. A bit surprised the Sherman could take all that fire we took from that AAA. Because of Sarge being known as one of the most reliable tank commanders out there, we were being sent just about everywhere there's fighting. So it wasn't long before we were somewhere hot and sandy, and I was wishing I could have cooled off on our porch with a nice iced tea. Alright. Well, once again, being forced way over to one area. Follow this guy for a little bit. Yep. He's gone. Alright. On our own. I know that with my crew and this vehicle not even being fully modified, I'm going to have to rely on flanking. Did none of the bad guys come up here? It's looking that way. Hmm. It's almost too quiet. Whoop. Oh man. <laughs> I thought that I thought that shell was gonna skip on the way. Ooh, that sounded close. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh my gosh, really? Jeez. Oh man. <laughs> Forty seconds. And we are sitting ducks right here. Down to just two crew and I see movement. Come on, gun. Oh, that's right, you only can click once. Ah. There we go. We're back. Excellent. Gonna have to make a run for A here at some point. Team is just getting rocked. Ooh. What? Uh oh. What? Oh my gosh. Yeah. Should have relocated. Okay, got 
my rudder and my ailerons mapped to different buttons here. All right. Wish we could get some movement on A up there. Ooh. Oh, really? There you go. Oh, man. I was really close by that tank. Oh, uh oh. throttle power at this point. We're leaking everything. Not going to be able to generate any more thrust. Now what can we do? Oh, that's not... Oh, that's a rock. Okay. Out of ammo. Damn it. Oh, hey. I see you. Ah. So close. You should have seen this flyboy. He flew right at him and then came back again. Luckily, he made it out okay and we picked up his crazy behind as we left the area. We had a heck of a day, but we lost that battle. We got some commendations for our gallantry, whatever that is. We're no stripe chasers, so the lost battle really stung, even if we did well as a unit. Please tell Ma and Pop hello for me, I'm sure they're worried. Please don't worry about me, though. With a group like ours, I know I'll be fine. Sarge simply won't let the enemy get us. It looks like we're moving out again. Know that I think about you every second I'm awake. Twice as often on those rare occasions when I get to sleep. I can't wait to see you again. Love, Johnny. 